Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will see a problem based on Wedley's rule under this numerical integration. A problem is evaluate integration of 4 to 5.2 log x to the base e into dx taking 6 equal strip by applying Wedley's rule. Solution. So, here the given thing that is let i equal to integration 4 to 5.2 log of x to the base e into dx. If you write only log x also no problem. It is understood it is base e. So, here the value of a is 5.2 value of uh, sorry value of a is 4 b value is 5.2 a is 4 lower limit and b is 5.2 that is upper limit and they have given 6 equal strip means n is equal to 6 so therefore so h is nothing but b minus a divided by n so b value is 5.2 minus 4 divided by 6 so on simplification it will become 0 0.2 so we have h value a value b value n value so now we will go for the table uh, we will construct the values of x as well as y so let us see the uh, construction of table now so here one more thing we need to identify and the value of y so this is the value of y that is log of x is the value of y so you have to take value of y is log of x a value b value h value so we will uh, see the table now so now we will see so here so this is x value so y is equal to log of x so this is y naught y1 y2 y3 y4 y5 and y6 so we need to fill the values of x so now we will prepare this y is equal to log x so log x to the base e means we have to use lan so shift option 7 so lan of alpha x okay equal to so starting value that is a value it is 4 and end value it is 5.2 and step size is 0 0.2 and see the table so it is given 4 4.2 4.4 then 4.6, 4.85 and 5.2. Uh, so we'll write it. So it is 4, 4 4.2, 4.4, 4.6, 4.8, then 5, 5.2. So you can see that starting is A, that is 4, and is 5.2, that is the value of B. So both are matching here. So, with respect to this 4, 4.2, so values of y, uh, we, uh, already we got it from the table. So, we will start here. So, for 4, it is 1.38629, so on. So, I will round up up to 4 decimal place. It is 1.3863. 1.3863. So, similarly, next, next value is 1.4351. 1.4351 so next 1.4816 1.4816 next for 4.6 it is 1.5261 1 1.5261 1 next for 4.8 1.5686 so 1. 5, 6, 8, 6. So, next value is for 5, it is 1.6094. 1.6094. Next, last one is uh, for 5.2, it is 1.64865. So, 1.6487 will take. 1.6487. 7. So, these are the table values now and with respect to this, this is a y0, y1, y2, y3, y4, y5 and y6. So, now, so we will use by Wedley's. So, by Wedley's, 
rule. So, Wedley's rule it is given by I times integration A to B y dx is equal to 3h upon 10 bracket so y naught plus I will write all first y1 plus y2 plus y3 plus y4 plus y5 plus y6 then you multiply 1 5 1 6 1 5 it is okay 5 times y5 plus so 1 5 1 6 1 5 1 so this is a formula you have to remember in this way now so therefore so i is equal to integration a is 4 to 5.2 y value is log of x into dx is equal to so 3 by 10 into h value is 0 0.2 into so enter the values of y naught so y naught value is 1.3863 plus 5 times y1 value is 1.4351 plus y2 value is 1.4816 plus 6 times so this is y2 value then y3 value 6 times 1.5261 next I will continue here plus y4 value is 1.5686 plus 5 times y5 value is 1.6094 plus y6 value is 1.6487 so these are the values of uh, y0 y1 y2 y3 y4 y5 and y6 so if you enter these all data at once in the calculator and if you simplify you will get a answer as 1.8279 so this is the answer of integration of 4 to 5.2 log of x dx so this is a required solution of a given integral using Wedley's rule under this numerical integration.